This is the Sun newspaper and it's Deirdre's photo casebook. Now I'm showing you this to prove a point about how interracial relationships are being impressed upon your unconscious mind and how people are being encouraged towards polygamous relationships and cuckoldry and things like this. Right. The story here, right, this is this is what it is. Yeah. The story here is him, he says, I take it all back, Sonia. You're without a doubt the least boring girl I've ever met. So he thought she was a boring girl. And to prove to him that she's not a boring girl, I'm really glad you think so, Gavin. Now, you will call me, won't you? So what's happened is she has decided to bring him and his black friend round to sort her out. So she can prove to him that she's not boring. Right, let's have a look what happened next. Strikes me that was all about getting you back. That strikes me that was all about getting you back, Gav. What do you reckon? Now that sentence can be taken in more than one way. Do you get what I mean? Like she's trying to get him back because he thinks that she's boring and she wants to keep him, so she's trying to get him back in the relationship. But he could quite easily mean this to mean she did it to get you back and look the expression on his face and the way he's looking it's like yeah he's not happy about it you see so she's trying to get him back and he says i reckon you're right mate but it'll take a lot more than a threesome to change my mind right okay so now i've proved sorry i'm reading through the camera hang on now now i'll prove what i'll do for gavin i'll just pray I just pray he changes his mind about splitting up. So, what she's done to keep her relationship with him is fuck a black man. And he is saying, I reckon you're right, mate, but it'll take a lot more than a threesome to change my mind. Well, hang on. Was this, what was in this for him? You know, I'm sorry, my bird wants to keep me in this relationship, yeah, get your fit little blonde friend round, and we'll have a threesome, me and two birds. Do you get what I mean? But no, here we have her trying to save her relationship with him by giving him what he wants, which is her fucking him. You see, it's even being sold to you in the paper. It's incredible. But the thing is, what you need to understand about this is for a man, a white man, reading that, it's giving him the belief that that white man wants her shagging the black man. Yeah, and now the white man goes through the thought process of why would a white man want that? And then you go through the full, full process. Do you see what I'm saying? Yeah. For a white woman reading it, because you have to. You, this is the thing. You only read from your own perspective. You only you only look at things through your own eyes. You have to look it through look at it through all the other ones as well. Yeah. To understand how the programming works. And for a white woman reading that, she's being taught that the way to get him back is play on his insecurities, because when he is Oh yeah, yeah. I'll come back. With, I'll come back. She's proved herself that she's not boring by having sex with a black man who is better than the white man. And now the white man is feeling inferior. And oh my God, yeah, yeah. Now she's got him on strings. You see. So now he will want to be with her. Just so she says, "Oh yeah, you were brilliant," and builds him back up again. And that's the way it works. Yeah, so it's like that simple little story is pathetic. Yeah, but this is this is the same in uh, the captions what I explained in Sissy Boom, the Sissy Boom video. This is programming. This is what it is. This is what it does. Plain and simple. Yeah, and it it plays with all different perspectives. And because you only look through your own, because you're not trying to analyze programming. 
yeah because you only look through your own eyes yeah it talks to you in one way it's like if i've got a bottle of coke yeah i've got a bottle of coke here and i'm trying to open it and it just won't fucking come it just will not fucking come yeah the 10 year old watching this sees me trying to open a bottle of coke they have no other reference for what that could mean but the subtextual communication that you pick up on being the dirty little bastards that you are it can mean something else as well you see you see how one thing can say different things to other people 